Tobago coach, player call out Usman they learned their lesson. Cuva, Trinidad and Tobago, Trinidad and Tobago assistant coach Stern John admitted his team was angered and inspired by the United States behavior in the build-up to the shocking World Cup result that dumped the Americans out of soccer's biggest tournament on Tuesday. John, a former Major League Soccer and English Premier League forward, mocked the USA's complaints about the waterlogged field at Otto Bolden Stadium a day before its disastrous 2-1 defeat to the home side. There was a lot of fire in our eyes, John told USA Today Sports. I think it was disrespectful of them. Catastrophic night, Usmund fails to qualify for 2018 World Cup. Usmund, five ways it went wrong. World Cup failure, biggest embarrassment in U.S. sports history? T plus T's win, combined with simultaneous victories for Panama and Honduras, sent the USA slipping to a fifth-place finish in the CONCACAF region's final qualifying round. Panama moved up into the third and final automatic qualifying spot, while Honduras faces Australia in a playoff. The USA has reached every World Cup since 1990 but will now be absent when the tournament kicks off in Russia next summer. On Monday, the visitors turned up for practice and were disturbed to find the track surrounding the field underwater and the playing surface itself drenched with rainwater. Many of the players had already taped their feet and put on their cleats, and were carried across the water by team staff to avoid getting their feet soaked. The Fuhrer instantly made its way on to social media. USA head coach Bruce Arena made no secret of the fact he was not impressed with the conditions, and T plus T, said John, was not impressed by the way the matter turned into a major incident. I think they were a bit overconfident and a bit disrespectful because they came in yesterday and rain fell on the pitch and they were giving each other piggybacks, over the water, and all kind of stuff, John added. Rain fell, it is not our fault. They made a big scene out of it and it was international news all over the world. It was all over the media. Our families, told us about it. Most of our guys are on social media so they see it. They see the USA guys getting piggybacked to the field, it is embarrassing. T plus T had previously lost six straight games and had gained only three points during the final phase of the road to Russia but played inspired soccer to hand the USA a devastating loss that can only serve to dampen the game's growing momentum in the country. For the home side as was a measure of revenge for the 1990 World Cup, when the USA qualified for the tournament for the first time in 40 years by winning in T plus T and thereby denying the Caribbean nation a place. Revenge, was in the back of the head but I don't think that was the main goal, midfielder Leston Paul said. The main focus was just on us. I think the, USA, was a little bit complacent because it is Trinidad and Tobago and we were already out. Football is a funny game. They learned their lesson today. Gallery, Usmond fails to qualify for World Cup.